these fuck niggas out here hate. Yeah, I heard it through the pipeline. Rumors about how they gon' rob me in the night time. For real, they just waiting for the right time. But guess what? You never catch me without mine. Without mine. 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 You never catch me without mine. Yo, what's good, man? This your boy Smoke Tales. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you got it on you because I got it on me. You know how we getting down on this end. Woman killed in shootout at strip club with security guard in Northwest Miami Dade. A woman is dead after a heated dispute at a strip club in Northwest Miami Dade ended in a shootout with a security guard early Friday, officials said. Miami Dade police officials said the incident unfolded at Club Climax on Northwest 27th Avenue around 3.20 a.m. Police said several individuals were engaged in a heated dispute inside the establishment, which then continued outside in the parking lot. An armed security guard that works for the establishment attempted to defuse the situation as is his job. Miami-Dade Police Andre Martin said. Martin said a woman who had been involved in the dispute got back in the back seat of the car and pulled out a gun and fired several rounds at the security guard. The guard returned fire hitting the woman as she was in the back seat of the car, Martin said. The driver of the vehicle drove away and parked at 27th Avenue Northwest 103rd Street where officers found the woman inside the car. She was pronounced dead at the scene. Police identified her as 32-year-old Shanae Cantel Johnson. Video at the scene shows Miami-Dade police officers surrounding the sedan that was riddled with apparent bullet holes throughout and the woman inside. The guard wasn't injured in the incident, Martin said. Now see, she fucked up. You get into an argument in the strip club and then you come outside and shoot at the security guard and don't know what the fuck you doing with the pistol and that's how you got off. Westview, leaving one woman dead. Olivia Jaquith has been on the scene for several hours now. Olivia, what's happening there? Well, this stretch of Northwest 27th Avenue was blocked off until just a few hours ago. Uh, you, it's being blocked right now by a truck, but just on the other side here is the strip club where it started. But it did end just a few blocks away. We spoke with a woman, you'll hear from her in just a moment, who says she's now searching for answers about what she believes happened to her daughter. Loved ones left heartbroken after a deadly shooting in Westview. So I got a call early this morning around 4 o'clock from my niece and she told me that my daughter was shot. She says she's not gotten confirmation from police but believes her daughter is the woman who was killed by gunfire in the back of this car as a driver pulled away from a strip club on Northwest 27th Avenue just before 3.30 this morning. I called every hospital. I called the police station. No one could give me answers. No one could give me any answers at all. I, I'm, I'm so weak. I can't do anything. Miami-Dade police have been working two scenes, shutting down the road for several hours this morning. One at the intersection with 121st Street, where they say a dispute started inside the club and spilled out into the parking lot. An armed security guard that works for the establishment uh, attempted to defuse the situation, as is his job. And the other at the intersection with 103rd Street, where they say this sedan drove off and a woman was found dead at the scene. A female involved in the altercation entered into the rear seat of a nearby vehicle, produced a firearm, and fired a shot at the security guard. Now, we just spoke with Miami-Dade Police, a spokesperson telling us that homicide investigators are in the process of interviewing anyone who may have been involved to try to learn more information. But what they have so far is that they believe the woman in the car fired first, and then they say the security guard returned fire and ultimately hit her. Again, this investigation is still ongoing. Of course, we'll bring you updates on air and online. But for now, we're live in Westview. Olivia Jake with NBC6 News. Whoa, man, you see how they getting down in Miami Dade, you know what I'm talking about? My hometown, where I'm born and raised. Shit go down out there, you know? She she was tripping, let her argument escalate. You gotta live a life of de-escalation once you start carrying a weapon, right? You can't be out here getting in the ego battles and all types of bullshit with different people. You know, you should just let that shit slide and go home. But nah, you wanna reach in the backseat, pull out a firearm, shoot at the security guard, and don't know what the fuck you doing with the gun, and end up losing your life all over nothing. Look like ass wasn't the only thing getting clapped at the climax. 
Man, this your boy Smoke Tails, man. Until next time, you never catch me without mine. Without mine, 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 you never catch me without mine.